Hey guys, welcome back. Today I wanted to share with you my most recent haul from Rose Girls. Um, she did a ready to ship restock last Friday, which whatever the date was. Um, today is June 18th, Friday. Um, so a week ago, this order actually came in yesterday. And let me just tell you, okay, first of all, I wasn't even going to order. I told, I looked at the list, made a list, and then said, no, you don't need anything. You have plenty of wax. But there were blends on here that I had never tried before and really, really wanted to. So we ended up going out to dinner. Um, we had reservations, and it was like right at the time um, <laughs> that the restock was launching, was going to be live on her website. So I just told myself no. So I left my list at home, but when we were in the car driving there, I said, oh my God, I have to. I couldn't stop thinking about it. So I ordered what I could remember. Um, the only thing that I forgot to order that was on my list was Cake by the Ocean. Um, so I'm sure I'll try that at some point. But so that was last Friday. I knew that my order was going to arrive yesterday. I kept watching the tracking because it was 119 degrees here yesterday. So I figured if I got it right when it was delivered, it would be fine. Well, it wasn't. My The mail truck in my neighborhood is very loud and the mailboxes are right outside of my house. So I knew it wouldn't sit long. I'd be stalking and I would get it as soon as it came. So got my package, opened it. Things looked a little melty, but not bad until I got to the bottom of my back my the bottom of my box and stuff was just melted mess no fault of rose girls crazy ass arizona ungodly gross weather 119 degrees so my poor package sat on the mail truck you know probably since seven o'clock in the morning it wasn't delivered here until 4 p.m yesterday so i stuck everything into my freezer for three hours <laughs> hoping that stuff would be okay so I'm going to show you what it looks like again. This is because of Arizona heat. Um, and it's not a huge order. Everything that I ordered is new to me except for one thing. Um, because I was totally out of it. So that was a lot to explain. So again, it all still smells really good. It just doesn't look good. So the sample that she sent is in Off the Hook. And Off the Hook is Ocean Salt water, sea kelp, oud wood, patchouli, and Indonesian amber. And this does smell really good. Ocean and sea salt. And a little, like, oud wood. This is nice. Really looking forward to warming that. Always appreciate the sample. Um, so I can save the business card. I'm telling you, this whole box just went right in my freezer. And of course, my husband's like, why is there a box of wax in the freezer? Um, okay, so I have mermaid hair, which I know is like a fruity blend. I was super excited to get this. Oh, so excited. Um, fruity, let me see if I can pull it up really fast. I probably can't, but I'm going to try. Um, bear with me, bear with me. Let me just see. Because I know I took pictures of stuff, but I might not, you guys. I'm sorry, I don't want to waste too much of your time. Where are you? What do you call mermaid hair? Yes. Okay. Mermaid hair. So I'm sorry. Ugh. It is honeydew, mandarin, kiwi, apricot, watermelon, tiare flower, lychee blossom, and coconut water. Honeydew for sure. Apricot, watermelon. I'm not really getting like the coconut or the lychee blossom, which I don't think lychee blossom is super strong. I could be wrong, but beautiful. I love the colors and anything that says mermaid in it, I'm obsessed with. Um, so gorgeous summer scents. Really cannot wait for that one. Um, 
Then I have Coastal Clothes on the line. Again, brand new to me. Super excited for this one. It's Coastal Kale and Soft Laundry. And I am a sucker for the kale. And this is beautiful. Perfect, perfect combination of laundry and um, kale. So these like look fine, just smudgy, but not at all melted. Oh, so, so good. So good. Oh, I'm so happy. There's that. Then I have Blackberry Rain. Um, which did I not? I thought I had this one like saved. So, wait a minute. Sorry. Blackberry Rain. Blends of fresh blackberries and sweet rain. And I love her blackberry. So this reminds me of, because I'm just mostly getting the blackberry. I don't know what the rain actually is. Sweet rain. Blend of fresh blackberries and sweet rain. So I think it was, excuse me, last summer she had that like blackberry puffs cream puff or fluff at something. I was obsessed with it. I bought so much of it, warmed through all of it. Um, so this sort of reminds me of that, only there's no bakery in here, but it smells delicious. Again, this one, not too melted. The things that were on top fared rather well in transit. Um, what do I have next? Poolside, which I know that that's one that she's had before, but I've never been able to um, to try it. It's Fluffy Towels Blackberry and Salty Sea Air. Again, I'm just like obsessed with her blackberry, so I will get to the blends um, that have that in there. This is good too. I didn't really smell them yesterday because like I said, everything was so super hot and, you know, melty. Um get like that laundry scent from the fluffy towels and salty sea air and slight, slight blueberry. I mean, blackberry. So these ones did kind of like meld a little bit together, but it still smells good. Totally um, can warm these. But again, just like a huge indicator to me. And again, I know better than to order wax when... The temperatures are horrific here, which it's going to be months of where it's too hot to, to um, water. So um, I'm very happy that I was able to get these. Sorry, I'm just trying to make sure that the bag is sealed. So that is poolside. So, so happy to have that one. I've been dying to try that one for like a really long time. Um, one of the good ones is steel, coriander, moss, bergamot, sandalwood, and kale. Gotta have that kale. And I do love her oak moss. Oh, this does smell good. Really, really good. You get the coriander. And I have a blend like Snuggle and Stainless Steel. And I think that that's what this steel is. So this is just a pretty gray wax. I'm sorry, sorry I'm not like showing. But um, yeah, one of the good ones. Oh, really happy. with this one too so good 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 then vibing which i had to order this one because first of all i mean i love the scent notes but my kids now that they're home for summer and um i ask them like what are you doing that this is the answer they give me vibing what are you doing i'm vibing so um needed to get this one and this is bamboo, sea salt, ocean, hemp, grass, and green vetiver. Definitely got um, bamboo and vetiver in this one for sure. Oh, this is just green and earthy. This is delicious. That ocean. Not really smelling sea salt. I really love this. I should have bought more of this because I think this will be a favorite. So that is vibing, loving that. So happy with everything. 
Now, the only repurchase that I need um, is Zen because I love it. It's something that I never get sick and tired of. Um, I had to get it. So, Zen is just like a <clears throat> clean, fresh spa scent. And this one, sadly, this is the one that was on the bottom of my, ba of my box. So, it kind of all <laughs> formed one big like wax bar but that's okay it still it smells amazing I will just chop it or break it it looks like it'll I can probably break it but I love Zen Ugh. and if I've purchased this once I've purchased this probably 20 times from Rose Girls this is just a great year-round calming soothing wonderful amazing scent that I love it's so good. That is it. I, mine just came in a uh, regional uh, rates box A. So I didn't get a huge order. But I just, I can't, I, I can't have any more wax coming in. I just, um, I can't. It's not worth it. Even when I get my mail the second it's delivered, it has still sat on um, the mail truck for, you know, a 10 hours or something and it's just not it's not worth it now I did order um like I said I have that Teddy B's pre-order that's coming in July and I'm like nervous and worried about that because of the heat um and L3 had her was it, unlim was it unlimited restock today? But I wanted one of the pride loaves. Um, so I did place a very small order, like a pride loaf and then like two scoopables or something. It's teeny tiny, um, which I'm going to be kicking myself about that one too. I'd like to think maybe the temperatures <laughs> will drop when that comes, but not going to happen. So if you live someplace where you are still having like cool weather, I am so jealous. Um, because you can order all the wax that you want. This is good for me to um, force me to slow my roll, which I need to anyway. Um, but I'm very, very happy. I'm so glad that I talked myself back into placing an order. Just a small order of things that I was super curious to try. Again, the only one that was on my list that I forgot, because I left my list at home, was the Cake by the Ocean. But other than that, I got everything that I wanted. And I'm so happy. Love, love, love Rose Girls. Um, she's been a favorite, one of, a, one of my favorites for several years now, and I will continue to purchase from her, just not when it's hot out. Um, so that's it, you guys. I hope everybody's having a wonderful Friday, that you're staying cool, and that you're enjoying whatever wax it is that you're melting, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye-bye.